Let me know that people call us Nigeria, Nigeria. Oh, Nigeria. Nigeria. People with different religion. Different religion. Different cultural tradition. Different language. Different in everything. Everything. Yeah. <laughs> Then you get to London, Manchester, everywhere. To be restored, great your friends be restored. I want freedom for my people. Freedom for Biafra. Where you Biafra? Land of the rising sun, Biafra, my hope, my father's land, Biafra, land of the rising sun. Yes, once again, what shall we do? What shall we do? Our song has not changed. Our message has not changed. Our resolve has been tested over and over. We are willing for more tests. What shall we see? There is no middle ground between what we are here to do. The civilized world has moved on. They know the truth. And sometimes I don't blame them because every one of these nations you talk about, they went through what we are going through today but they stood their ground. Like as we are standing our ground, and you know what? It doesn't matter what anybody thinks. It doesn't matter who the beneficiaries of this zoo are. Everybody must hail Biafra. It's just a matter of time. And when we tell you, you don't understand. You can't see. It's okay. It's okay. It took them almost 200 years to bring us down to one Nigeria. And then God is merciful that in less than five years, you are weak. It's a miracle, honestly. So when you are yapping and say, oh, I'm Igbo, I'm not Biafra. I'm Isha, I'm not Biafra. I'm Abu, I'm not Biafra. We don't blame you. The gospel has gone down to Abazonia. They are even waking up when we have not woken them up. We don't blame you. It took them 200 years to bring us down to our news. And it's still going on. That is why today they are proud to say we must have Ruga settlement for foreigners who are fellow Futajalon terrorists. Wanderers caused by the Almighty Creator, we must have your land. And to some of you, it's okay, let us share because Yoruba pastor is brainwashing you. Do I blame you? But don't worry. <laughs> Why are you wishing? Why are you wishing? Why are you wishing? Of course, this is Radio Biafra Extra. We are streaming live through Radio Biafra London, being anchored by the deputy leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. His name is Mas Yuchu Kafome they simply say, I will not allow the heart of this project to see corruption. For two years on, this platform suffered in the hand of terrorists. Terrorists sabotage, I must tell you. Nothing they didn't do. And I tell you, when we see what people like the deputy Uchimefo have gone through, it helps us to prepare our mind for the worst. 
And then there are some say, oh, we will deal with him, we will show him. Thunder will fire all of you. Whoever come here for anything, the only thing that drives us here is one truth. Number two, our hatred for one Nigeria. This is just the perfect avenue to express ourselves. Thunder will fire you if you think we are here for any other reason. You she. Take the chieftaincy title, it belongs to you. Take all the money, it belongs to you. You own everything, take it all, even now in Joshi. But God will judge all of us in the end of the day. If those who have sinned die, die for nothing, we shall know. In our time and before our time, those who will still die tomorrow, we shall see if their blood will rest. They will not spare anybody, including me. If I toy with the generation of the Biafran I meet, if I ever play with those who were there before me, or endanger the life of the next generation. May he chuko kikabi. I'm going to wipe out everything that concerns me. There are mad people. It's business as usual. Let us see how it is. As which he may fall by now, would have been competing with people like Ofo. What did they call him? Ofo Gene. When Asari, Asari as hopeless and useless as he is, he's showing you Range Rover Sport. Range Rover Sport. Go and look at all the 419 Babangida breed. All of them, well, what do they need the Range Rover stuff for? Yeah, look at my car and made money in Yoshi. Let our leader come out today and tell us the private jet he will buy. If IPOB cannot buy it for him in one year, even we will pay for the private jet they have not even manufactured before. You are showing us Range Rover. They think see, we are here to, to sell personality. Mad people. Masu Chimefo simply say, I will not allow the heart of this project to see corruption. And all of you are testament to that fact today. Of course, he's standing in a deputizing capacity on behalf of our Supreme Leader, Mazen Nanjoku Kano, the Prince of Afali Ibeku. Some of you are king and queen, and your children are prince and princess by certificate from one slave of our Safulani. There are things we check, but most of you will not know. Have you ever wondered why the palace of Afali Ibeku? Is very close to the government house in Abia State. And every house in GRUA there is only the road that leads to the palace of Afali Beku that has not been tied. That is to tell you how upright people believe. They will not believe on the street of gold on the expense of their people. And today I'm very happy that that man gave birth to our leader because he didn't compromise. How do you think his son will compromise? Yushi. Mazen and Yukukano is from Afali Beku. Afali Beku is no more here. No more here. It's in Abia State, and Abia State is Biafra land. And by the special grace of Chuko Kikabiyama, I am George Onibe. I will simply say there is no shadow of turning within us. We've prepared our heart for this journey. Should I say it is our calling? We are answering our calling. That is why many hopeless pastors are serving Yoruba, and they say they are, they are answering their calling. You are not called to lead the Yoruba, for in the end we are the true children of the Most High. I do worship us. I hey, I get to give. Don't let me talk to all of you. And I will say to you this moment, I serve the indigenous people of Biafra. IPOB, no other one. The only people with Biafran flag and they are, they are proscribed. The only people who have not killed anybody and they are proscribed. I serve them. And if being IPOB is a terrorist issue, I will be a terrorist in a hundred lifetimes. For we have said to the Almighty Creator, if what we are doing here today make us sinner, we are very sorry because in a hundred lifetimes we will sin against you. But of course, who are we without him? And that is why we humble ourselves before him every day and night. We continue to seek his face. Ebu <laughs> Manite no go go, ya kai jina se ne bu chanyo. Tanye na jagi mau, ni shuku ni maramai, ihuna nyane nagi, 
Ubi o maki, o juru anyanya daju, ingwe kimbangwe u, odi gunye de kagi, nibu afano mega, anye nini na sena ede mau, o kwa gibwe cheto ubiye sike u, o kwa gibwe kai jagaga u, o kwa gike walo similile i, Ime kwa mwanya ga koturu ime o. O kwa giyo chineke. Ibo ke milini ibugui. O kwa giyo chineke ma o. Ibu chim. Ibu chim o. Ibu chim o. Ibu chim. Ibu chanya ija honzo e. Agada bajiri songo kubi oma. Uli la nyanke ndi biafra u. Anyire re roko na nyina baroko. Oke ne kage jituru gi yege na u. Agama kwisala yege na mo. Nibu chi. Chukwo ede ma o, Jihova ede ma, O lilia nyandi ay piyo bi ede ma o, O makay se biyo wale ede ma, Ezi chine ke mo, Na le ke le o, Bwe ni ne, let us stop here. When we tell you this is where we worship, you don't understand. You think that you are Yoruba church, you are the glory, you are the, you think that's where you are worshiping him. He knows his people. He knows his people. Of course, we appreciate him and we must move ahead. Our topic this evening is simple. An open letter to the good people of the world. Open letter to the global community. Open letter to homo sapiens. Body terrorists, everybody. This is an open letter to all of you regarding the recent happening. It's an open letter. But we will read that letter until we... Let's just listen to one audio. And then from there, we read it later. And the German police authorities have been speaking on the incident of the assault against the former Senate or former Deputy Senate President, Senator Eke Kweremado, which happened in Nuremberg over the weekend. The police there described the incident as a demonstration by those who attacked the lawmaker and that no arrests were made in relation to the FACA. The police officer was speaking to a freelance journalist uh, Rona Mayer in an exclusive interview with Channels Television. Hello. Hello. I have a few questions about the case. Uh, there is nothing, uh, uh, not very much uh, about this. Um, the Secretary from Nigeria came and about 30 people uh, demonstrated against him and then he, um, uh, the police was called and they calmed the situation and the secretary or minister who he was uh, drove away with his car and uh, everything was over. There is nothing, uh, nothing happened. So there are not going to be any arrests or any any no, no, investigation. No, 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 no arrest, nothing. Uh, the police calmed the situ situation. There were about thirty persons who demonstrated against uh, this minister, or who he was, and he get back in his car and drove away and flew back to Munich, I think Munich, and then back to Nigeria. Okay. And nothing. Nobody. Nobody was arrested. Uh, so I know. Okay, so the investigation is closed as it is. Yes. Okay. It's no, uh, no police investigation. But of course, we will still go back to it. Hey, look, this is Nigerian Yoruba Gota Media. They were calling German. Hey, hey, German, you know, please, oh, uh, these are people that uh, insulted one of our honorable. You know, he's a lawmaker. Uh, what are you going to do to the IPOB? You think German people are stupid? They must have made their mistake in the past, but they are not stupid. German know they don't have yam, they have potato. How can you be so stupid and hopeless to come to Germany to eat yam? Do you want to pollute Germany? You want to spoil German? Go and do Iriabuna, Japan, Japan now in the ocean. You do Iridrindomi in Japan. Iri potato in Germany. Iri donut in America. Iri suya in Saudi Arabia. Okay, they don't. What do the Saudi Arabia even eat or Dubai people? Iran, Aram, Melu, Melu, Nachana. You do it in Biafra land. Don't you get it? If any, you know. 
Yeah, so you investigate them. You think they don't know what it what it means. You you think you, do you know what chairman sacrificed to get there? Do you know how many people they have to slaughter and how many people slaughter them to be there? You think they are stupid? Yeah, yeah, one well, Nigeria. They are killing your people everywhere. You are not pushing button to stop this evil. You are only getting intention when it comes to the issue of Nigeria. Hey, he said, one well, Nigeria. Hey, please, uh, hey, this idea be what? It is our right to civil disobedience. Don't you get it? It is our right to self determination. Don't you get it? Everybody say, hey, let them arrest him, let them prosecute them. It will stop. It will never stop. It will never stop. Any nation who try to oppress us or stop us will never be free. Their next generation will never benefit, reap from what they have sown. You think we don't know what happened? Go back to history and look at all the people who killed the generation of Biafra between 1967 and 1970. And tell me how many of them that are happy today. Only those who hide under that umbrella. And they will suffer under that umbrella. Criminals. And so are you not going to punish them? You think German people are stupid? You think the world don't know what Nigerians is? You think the world don't know who Fulanis are, who Yorubas are, who Awosa are? You think the world don't know what British government is doing that is long overdue? You think they don't know? Even Britain citizens know that what their government is doing is safe for. You think they are not listening, they don't know? But Tonda will fire all of you. Get ready to stop this tiny Biafra because you are not ready for what is coming. The plague that will be fair, you people don't have name yet. No, they listen to it. This is Yoruba. Uh, they, they want to uh, uh, jam and tell us now you have to uh, exercise the uh, repatriate uh, Biafra, uh, uh, repatriate them. And the German police authorities have been speaking on the incident of the assault against the former Senate or former Deputy Senate President. Senator A.K. Kwaremado, which happened in Nuremberg over the weekend. The police there described the incident as a demonstration by those who attacked the lawmaker and that no arrests were made in relation to the fracker. The police officer was speaking to a freelance journalist, uh, Rona Meyer, in an exclusive interview with Channels Television. Hello? Hello? I have a few questions about the case. Uh, there is nothing, uh, uh, not very much uh, about this. Um, the secretary from Nigeria came and about 30 people uh, demonstrated against him and then he, um, uh, the police was called and they calmed the situation and the secretary or minister who he was uh, drove away with his car and uh, everything was over. There is nothing, uh, nothing happened. So there are not going to be any arrests or any, any further no, no, investigation? No, 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 no arrests, nothing. Uh, the police calmed the situ situation. There were about 30 persons who demonstrated against uh, this minister, who he was, and he get back in his car and drove away and flew back to Munich, I think, Munich, and then back to Nigeria. Okay. And nothing, nobody, nobody was arrested, uh, so I know. Okay, so the investigation is closed as it is? Yes. Okay. It's no, uh, no police investigation. What are they going to investigate? You think the world has not moved on? This is Nigerian criminal. Oh, we just protested in Biafra land and say, no, release our leader. Let the issue of Nigeria be renegotiated as they did in Aburi Accord, as they did in, in deceiving the say, oh, national conference, national conference. You think the, this world has not moved on? You think you're happy with what you are doing to us? And then you are trying to bribe German. Do you have anything to bribe German? Do you know German have been building their country on the expense of their people? Do you know they have worked earnestly and sincerely to build German? If any mono, are you people not ashamed? 30 IPOB member stopped one criminal who have looted resources meant for a thousand generation. And you think anywhere we save all of you, your children we will drag them out. Just get ready. It is gradual process. The more you think you will oppress us and shut us down, the more you will see how miserable you and your children will be. You have made us miserable. You have made our mothers childless and our father wifeless and husbandless. If you understand what that means, you have made us homeless. There are things people do not understand. We wake up every day with regret in our heart. Why did we get involved in this thing? Because our life has been taken from us.
but every day yet we thank the almighty creator that we are still standing on the right path till this moment that if we will die tomorrow if we will die tonight let it be that we choose how we will die we will never die cowardly you're hey, not going to persecute them hey, you think they are still living the same back criminals like you where are your pastors? Those of you on Facebook, like, that is the picture of IPOB member trying to agitate. They were shot openly. Live bullets, Nigerian police. What did we do? When they see us, they become powerful. What power? When they, they, they in fact, they are the Boko Haram. Nobody call it British or CNN or America. I say, this issue of killing people. Why are you? The only people is Amnesty International. And then there is another sabotage saying, no, Amnesty, leave our land. You want to destroy our land. Are you a criminal? Only criminal defend Nigeria. The world should look. Anybody defending one Nigeria, no matter who they are, they are the criminal. They are the plague of this earth. They are the evil people that must be stopped. Oh, we don't have nuclear warhead and you cannot respect us. Anyway, let us move ahead to our topic. Don't forget our topic is open later to the world. Let's read the letter. It is important that we bring this issue to your notice. Not because you are not aware of it, but because our next line of action is not even known to us, not to talk of anyone else. For in the end, we will confront Nigeria and the handlers of Nigeria in such a way unimaginable, and Nigeria will not survive, neither will the handlers of Nigeria go anyway with the atrocity and he knows crime against our people. It's not as if you are not aware, you are aware. But let's remind you that this one we have entered, Nigeria will not escape it. Neither will the handlers of Nigeria. They will not escape what is coming for them. They can intimidate and harass us with army. They can terrorize our land with the oil company like share, sponsoring terrorism and cultism in our land, making our homes uninhabitable. They will not go away with it. But we are writing to the global community. You know what is happening. You can pretend you don't know, but it's okay. This is an open letter to all of you. That number one, these people destroy the economic sector in Nigeria. And so they invest in diaspora. And we say no to this. They cannot allow any industry to build in Biafra land. Only cattle ranching. It's what they are fighting to turn to bring cattle colony to our land. Ruga, uh, reserve grazing bill. This Sototororo, Sototororo, different name. They won't allow us to build industry. But they steal the money, the resources from our land, and they all have investment around the globe. We will not allow. It will not be that way. We want to bring it to the notice of the war that these people destroy the economic sector in Nigeria, and they send their children to school in diaspora. There is no senator, including that Abaribe. Oh, sorry, did I say Abaribe? Okweremado. There are children's school in diaspora. They have destroyed the school in Nigeria. They have destroyed the school. I have to send my son out of Nigeria because at the age of 13, he wrote his Waek and he got all the paper. Nigerians say he's too small. When Waek was collecting the money, they didn't know he's too small. Now I have sent him out. I have to pay his school fees through my nose. Ndyoshi. They destroy the economic educational sector. I don't even know what is what. Today they say we are doing education, three CCs. Tomorrow they will say education, seven, 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 education, four, four, four. Different schools are confused. They are confused now. And these people send their children to school in diaspora. All of them are everywhere enjoying, but that enjoyment will not last long, except Nigerian divide. We are bringing it to you that these people should bring their children back home here. You hardly hear about scholarship any longer. But their children are being sponsored everywhere in the world. And you cannot claim that you don't know. You Google every politician in Nigeria and it will amaze you where their children school. Because they have destroyed our economic system. Go and look at the number of females that graduate from Nigeria University. They are 70% compared to men, 30%. Why do you have more women graduating from university? Because all the lecturers sleep with all of them, pregnant all of them. Give them a high degree. They can't even spell their name. But the men will have to go and rob or join courtes to kill for the lecturer before they can graduate out. Or pay them money. But of course, it's what the system takes. It's 
to in the end, when you graduate from Nigeria University, you are not full any or Yoruba. You will stay at home very well. Why do you think you don't have a job? Because the education system you are going to is a cake. That was the same school Mongo Park went to, if they ever went to school. You are following the same standard of education Landa Brothers and Mary Slesso went to, if they ever went to school. You went to the same school system with terrorists Luga and Flora Shaw, if they ever went to school. That is the same school system they are practicing in Nigeria. Somebody in university, they will now come and teach them for that mass. Our further mathematics in Nigeria University is uh, 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 algebra or equation eh? for that mass. University, a lecturer will come and say, Yes, uh, we are going to look at algebra. Algebra of two plus two is equal to seven because horse raised to power 20, thereby divided by 15, is called Ozumuron. Offset, Yana. Yeah, that is your further mass. Somebody university, I tell you, two times one and two, two times two and four, two times three, sixteen, two times seven, fourteen, two times nineteen, twenty, two times eleven and twenty. In university in Nigeria, shame on all of you. And that is why you see them everywhere. Hey, we are intellectual, we are opinion moda, we are the intellect. Look at them; they don't have anything in their brain. Common sense, they don't have. Go and look at all the intellectuals. All of them are doctor, doctor, doctor. Whether they are native doctor, I don't even know. That is one thing we need to find out. All these doctors everywhere in Nigeria, are they native doctor? Because I don't know how they reason. Doctors have been analyzing about Ikwe Keremado and Ikwe Keremado Ike, uh, this one and that one. Look at civilized German people. They just told you these people have not done anything wrong. It is their right to protest. Certainly it is our right. But you are a doctor, you are analyzing it. It's going to be bad for image of Nigeria. Does Nigeria have good image before? Does Nigeria have good image? Open later to the world. All these people, their children are schooling in diaspora, but they have destroyed the educational system in Nigeria. We will come for their children. Their children must come back and school with us. If not, if not, this fire, they have light close to the grave will consume all of them. Open later to Nigeria. Number three. They systematically create unemployment, which makes the people to wander across the globe. We say no to it. That is on daily basis our people are being massacred. Nobody is talking about it. Our sister who gave news talked about uh, 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 Arewa Abikuri Dabire, the Yoruba girl who married a Biafra man and think he can go away with it. These people are evil. When Yoruba is involved, that is where you hear the amount. We say no. Biafras are dying everywhere in, in different prisons across the globe, facing death sentences, some of them for the crime they didn't commit. And Nigeria will never talk about it. The day you hear Nigeria talking about it, you know. So just wait and listen. The thing may be okay, we're just blabbing. It is real. They charge into your car and see how you look. You know, you're Nigerian or whatever, and they stop you and to harass you. They've got the rest of them now, you see, they are coming. I think the bullies are here now. You are done? You are done? Yeah. I, no, no, I'm not done. I'm not done. Do anything you want. This is South Africa or killing Nigeria, so. We are, we are on Belmont Road in Santi. My man, don't touch me like that. Why are you beating me? Why, why are you hitting me? I cannot drop my phone. This is my own right. See the way they are treating me. Can you see the way they are treating me? Can you see the way they are treating me? Can see the way they are beating me? Can you see? That was Tai of Fanero on Nigerian level in South Africa who was assaulted. The reason you are hearing this one now, this is Yoruba I'm going to talk because it's Yoruba they molested. Do you know how many Biafrans that have been murdered? Nigeria will never talk about it. Rather, some stupid Biafrans will join them to Yoruba church and go and sing to You go and rejoice that they have killed one of your brother. Now, Abikaru Daburi or whatever her useless name is, we is now projecting this because South African beat up Yoruba. He's warning that don't beat Awosa, don't beat Fulani, don't beat Yoruba. We told you to kill Oli Ibu. 
We say no more. It will not continue that way. Let's finish it so you understand what you are saying. Third on his way to work on July 25, 2019, at a press conference hosted by the Director General, Nigerians and Diaspora Commission, Honorable Abike Dabri Ewa, she catalogs figures of Nigerian deaths in the hands of South African police officers. Up till about 2016, we've had about 118 Nigerians killed in South Africa. This is the Yoruba woman who, Yoruba woman, sneak into the life of a data man and they think they can go away with it. I pity all of you who marry Yoruba woman. I pity all of you. May God have mercy upon you. Now, Fana and Amen. Just listen to what she happened. Between 2016 and today, it is Nigerians have been killed in South Africa. Mm. Over 88. Um, I think 25 were cases of Nigerians killing Nigerians. And then we had the case of Elizabeth Chuku, who was murdered in a hotel room. Now, this is what we demand. Eight policemen are currently being investigated in South Africa for their involvement in killings against Nigerians. That, was, that investigation... But that is a lie. Eight policemen may be under investigation in South Africa for killing Yoruba shareholder. Don't you know South Africans and part of the people making our life miserable as Biafrans? Go and ask Go TV. Go and ask DSTV. Go and ask MTN. Go and ask ShopRite. Go and ask South African investors in Biafra land. But the point is, we the Biafran fought side by side to make sure that our party was lifted. We the Biafrans fought for them. But don't worry. In due time, all of you will receive your salary. And so we, the Biafran people, are writing an open letter to the world and say, based on all these foundings, we say no to the one Nigeria. And everything they are doing today, make no mistake about it. Understand our stand, why we are doing what we are doing. Our intention, our target. Make no mistake about it. They make sure that we do not have access to electricity in order to discourage industrialization. In return, the import generator, the more we buy generator, the more we become poorer. And we say no to this. Most of you don't know. Every year since I was born, uh, we are, the government is working hard so that next year we will have 100 electricity megawatts. Then 10 years later, they will be fighting for uh, uh, 50 electricity megahertz. It never go forward to make sure there is no electricity, to discourage industrialization. Then they import generator for us. Getting a generator is one thing. Buying fuel for generator is another thing. If I open the room where I'm broadcasting now, you hear generator. My own generator says, for all the rain, wash, I don't finish. The sand alone, if you put it in America, is going to deafen all the American people. That's why the thing they shout. Yoshi. I'm, I'm getting headache, headache in my sin from my generator. I'm bet, getting for my sin. There is no atrocity generator is not committed against, against me. Yoshi. We say no to it. We are telling the global community. You just, it's before your plane lands, the sound of generator in Nigeria will dominate the sound of the aircraft that is bringing you in here. And so when you see them coming, oh, we are Nigeria, we need solution. Tell them to go and divide Nigeria. That is only where solution will come. These are criminals. This is an open letter to remind the world about what is going on. They create insecurity. With the security agency protecting them and leaving the common man without protection, we say no. Oh, Fulani Hesman, this, Boko Haram, this, Miati Allah, this, but they are the same security Nigeria have. They protect these criminals. They leave the common man without protection. They just wake up one day and decide the land to take and the one not to take. They wake up one day, decide who will die and who will not die. The world must know this and we say no to this. These are criminals. There is no difference between Nigerian Army, Nigerian Police, Nigerian Civil Defense, Nigerian Immigration, Nigerian Road Safety, Nigerian Custom, Boko Haram, Fulani, Esme, Miati, Allah. They are all the same. We say no to it. Enough of all this deceit. It's an open letter to the world anyway. They create chaos with the intention to destroy us. And why they do this? They run to diaspora with their family to enjoy. 
we say no. In as much as they are destroying our land, Asari children are not in Biafra land. I challenge Asari, let him come to River State. He's a River State man. Let him come to River State so that he will know he's a very hopeless animal. When I tell some people some things, they don't understand. Asari is from River State, not Bayasa. Bayasa people shift away from him so that I will not bring his plague on you people. And those of you following him already, may God have mercy upon you. Amen. In the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Come to River State and yap, hopeless animal. This is an open letter to the world. Let them know who you people really are. You create chaos. Send your children diaspora. You want to kill us here. Oh, look for them. Let's kill them. You are miscreant. You will kill, honestly. You have been killing. You will still kill. You will kill more. But what is coming for all of you? Nobody can stop it. The only thing that will stop this thing is divide Nigeria. British can be stealing all you, no problem. But Nigeria must be divided. Therefore, we appeal to you, those of you who are there to work hard for Nigeria, let them be. For those who are politicians coming to hide, please repatriate them. Repatriate them. Stop them from coming to your land. Stop issuing them visa. America has taken a bold step. Let them come and enjoy the Nigerian. They claim they love. And I hope you people will understand. Oh, this is our one Nigeria. Please let them come and enjoy one Nigeria. Don't let them come to your land any longer. When they are sick, they run to India. They, they are running up and down. We don't have hospital. When you go to hospital now, immediately before doctors in Nigeria will attend to you, they will give you card, soundboard. I call it quotation. In that quotation, doctors will give you or hospital will give you. Number one on the list, generator fee, 5,000. Petrol for generator, 5,000. Consulting doctor, 5,000. Tissue paper, 2,000. When they finish giving you quotation, drug is not there. You will even say, God, kill my child quickly. God, kill this, my father, quickly. Because quotation they will give you, they can buy life. Ngushi. Hey, it's our one Nigeria. It cannot integrate. The integrity of one Nigeria. A Nigeria image cannot be destroyed. Who told you? Is it not a shame among nations? Sorry. Is it not a shame among countries? Even all the created country, all the created company, I mean, by Britain and France, and then German or whoever created country, Portuguese, whoever still have company in Africa. Nigeria is the worst, shameless, disgraceful, hopeless, animalistic, cheat hole, toilet, terrorism. Give it name. Give it name. For the cabals in Nigeria, I hope you are ready. Because this rain, this rain will fall. It will beat all of us. It will beat your children, your loved ones. It will beat your allies. It will group beat your group. It will beat your churches. It will beat your dog, your goose. It will beat you in your grave. It will beat you in your going out and in your coming in. It will beat you. There will be no escape for you. But don't worry, we will get to you. Make no mistake about it. We are not here to advocate violence because it's not our style. It is our right to civil disobedience. It is our right to self-determination. It is our right to restore Biafra. And that is the only thing we are here to do. Nothing more and nothing less. Make no mistake about it. We are Biafrans, and we want our land and our life restored back to us. The world must take notice of this issue. Nigeria will never allow that day to come. They will never allow these changes to be made. And in the same way, we will start from Biafran saboteurs. We will go down to Duduwa and Arewa. We will make sure that bullet they shoot in Biafra land for three years. Starved our people to death. We will make sure Nigeria will not go with it. They want Ruga and they shall get Ruga. But the only solution, let Biafrans go. 
And for you, Biafrans, wherever you are across the globe, who have not seen, who has not joined IPOB, please look for one and join. And for those of you who are members of IPOB already, you are Biafran soldier. And I see it's going to be all right. I'll be back in a minute. This song is dedicated to the victims of this genocide. Those who lost their lives from 1967 to this very moment. I had to do this song with we will. But God, a man, I don't believe you. Shake a man, could you be to you? But God, a man, listen up. Tell that your soldier that he's going to be alright. I need to tell that your soldier that he's going to be alright. Follow me, tell that Jaffrak soldier that he's gonna be alright. Follow me, tell that Jaffrak soldier that he's gonna be alright. Tell that Jaffrak soldier he's gonna be alright. Follow me, tell the wounded he's gonna be alright. The spirit of our fathers. Bring us down. They want it to be keep rising up. See betrayers wanna bring us down. They want it to be keep rising up. Bring your gold and your bullet and bazooka and your grenade and be our friends. We will fight till the end. See them sabotage, playing cowardice in the corner. But we will win them all. I said we will win the war. Man, the kind who is the leader. He says he's gonna be alright. He's gonna be alright. Tell that Jaffrak soldier that he's gonna be alright. I need to tell that Jaffrak soldier that he's gonna be alright. Follow me, tell that Jaffrak soldier that he's gonna be. of our freedom we are fighting for a better life one thing i know for whatever backward labor we will one day have in candy someday sometime soon tell that different soldier that is going to be alright i need to tell that different soldier that is going to be alright Follow me, tell that soldier that it's going to be all right. Yes, sir. Honestly, it's going to be all right. Those of you on Facebook, I have been placed on a temporary, uh, how do they call it, uh, uh, premature or whatever. Anyway, you may be cut off any moment from now, but don't worry, we will still come back. They have to shut down their Sabbath. They take advantage of the single father that you are peace loving people. They take advantage of the single father, the principle that is laid from the very fabric of our existence, whether matana or patana. It's 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 just peaceful, but it can't continue this way. If it's if the peace we project threaten our existence, and then we will improvise. As long as they open this hour, I must tell you, 
Our WhatsApp line remains 070 815 Our direct line is 081 221 Our direct line again is 081 221 Special number for the female is 081 58614. Special number for the female 081 288 of course, if you are calling outside this, you just put plus two, three, four, remove the zero there, and then continue with the rest number. Allah is open, and you are free to call in. Yes, a caller on WhatsApp, your name, and where are you calling from? Good evening, Mazi Jojo. Good evening, my brother. Go ahead, please. Good evening, good evening. Thank you, my African rep. Um, I just want to add my voice to the topic of tonight's broadcast later to the world. The world must understand that we, Biafras, we are not funny. They have taken us for granted for too long, and we cannot overemphasize the need for Nigerians to be divided. Nigerians have caused humanity more harm than good. Our senators, in fact, Nigerian senators, not our senators, Nigerian senators from Southeast, they have taken advantage of us for too long, and they have trampled on our rights. What happened to the escape goat Ik Wamadu in Germany is just an iceberg on the cake for what will happen to every Southeast politician. I am saying this categorically clearly for all Southeast politicians to get ready. Most of them they have been yapping, some of them they have been talking nonsense. It is left for them. We don't care and we will not care. Our leader has given us the instructions, both of our brothers in diaspora. It is now in their hands to do the needful. Wherever you see any Southeast politician in diaspora, disgrace that person, beat that person, expose that person. The country police of that nation, that country, they will bear witness to what will happen to that person because we are the indigenous people of Biafra worldwide. We are not terrorists. Nigeria must be divided or the world will know no peace. The voice of whom you are hearing this very evening is no other than Mazi Adizobitakawanko, also known as Zale Chuku Batista on Facebook. By the privilege of Chuku Kika Biyama, I am the deputy coordinator of IPO Chuku Echemzo to Aba. Mazi Jodoibe, thank you. Chuku Kika Biyama will continue to strengthen you. And you, my brother. Good night. Thank you. We are not going anywhere. Are you there Hello? on the line? Ada, go ahead, please. My name is Ada. I'm coming from Ada. Go ahead. Last week, I'm so happy this line. For the past three hours, I feel insane because of the news that you received from the newspaper media of this week. So you know that uh, all those people that are that that are past the mother of civil liberties, they are all being protected. They think, uh, they think Germany not, is a zoo like Nigeria. They think the German is a zoo. They know the truth. What we are doing is our right. This is one thing they don't want you to know. It's our right to civil Amen. disobedience. Thank you so but even if they, they are... Thank you, thank you, my sister. Even if they decide to arrest them, they to cover the truth. You can't. This is the land of the rising sun. Everybody must help Biafra in the end. It doesn't matter how rugged the road will be, but we will walk it to the end knowing fully well that the almighty creator is on our side. There is nothing anybody can do about it. And without apology, we will not apologize for who we are. We are Biafrans. We are Biafrans. Call on WhatsApp, are you there? Yeah, Mazi, all here Biafra. All here Biafra. Go ahead, please. Yes, I want to thank you, Mazi Onyib. I want to thank our great leader, Mazi Namdekano and Deputy Uche Mofo. And I want to thank all the whole beer friends in diaspora and at home. So um, what happened in Germany, Mazi, is just a demo. Everybody should understand what demo is all about. When you want to release an album, you first of all bring out a demo. A demo is to show the, the, how, the, how the music is going to be structured before the main music will be out. So, a Kuremado should be happy 
that what happened to him is just a small test. A demo. A demo. A demo. Not the Before reason. the music. You, the, what they no, should no, have no. been hearing is that when they slap a Kuremado, the guy pull on the trouser. Then we'll be yeah. videoing the shit. It won't say. Nonsense, people. Then so, he, 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 he by now he's supposed to be on the media and be saying, "Hey man, ano manu anu, ano manu anu, itun bi aidiji." The best part, of course, he should be appreciated because if all Jews or Carlo come to Spain, let them enter plane and come and do aidiji in, in in Spain. We are waiting for them. The next thing, Yoruba hey, should be ready to video shit because these people will pull on their trouser. I be hearing ano manu anu because they want to cover the fact that all hot slap made them to start project. Mad people. That that is how it's going to be mass. Eh? What I'm trying to tell them is, although before I proceed, I still remember Mazin Weke okay, Chuku from on a base in a bony province, Biafra land. So as I said, that this is just a demo. Anyone who is a musician to understand or who have no idea about music should know. Before the main music will be played, will be out, the demo will come out. So what the model saw was just a demo. And this is for them to know that there's a little hand on the wall. That if they happen to cause, if they didn't find solution and let Biafra go, when they cause war, no, there will be no hiding place for them. There will be no hiding place for their children. I want to thank God because Chico Kadam have made it that Biafra are everywhere in the world. We know their children. We don't know where they're schooling. There's no place in the world, even at Park and Border, you will not see their friends. There's nowhere. And the, if happened to be war between Nigeria and the Georgian Republic of Nigeria and Biafra, this is going to be hot for them. There will be no hiding place. They will sit in Biafra land or in Nigeria, the so called Nigeria, and they eat that shit. We are waiting for them everywhere. We are waiting for them. Let them come. Let them come. Thank you very much. Oh, hey, Biafra. Oh, hey, Biafra. It is simple. We've notified the world the reason why we are doing what we are doing. They say we will not sleep in our own home. They design different kind of terrorist act against us. But the truth remains that Peking will say, Mama, no go sleep. He no go sleep. They won't even sleep in Nigeria. Their children will not sleep anywhere in the world. We will get to that stage. We will get to that platform. Then they will not worry. Hey, how dare this a terrorist because we carry flag? Don't worry. You will see terrorists you've never dreamt of. You have a Buku Hara. You will see Biafra Hara when the time come. Are you there, Kola on WhatsApp? Yes, I am here. Go ahead, please. My rep, Mazonibe. The strong man. Yes. Um, you have started to do it what you know how to do best. Uh, my name is still remain Ezekwem Uchechi. I'm from Amuro of Kiwe province Biafra land. I'm calling from Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Our rep, there's clip we just played when you were analyzing the topic. I am just baffled. What these people are interested is to know, Yoruba Gota Media is no, to know to lobby if an arrest has met. They want to lobby Jama. My goodness. They me. must have called Jama and say, hey, we want you to make example out of those people. Hey, how many are you aware? They are, the only well is in our land. If Germany was a corrupt nation like Britain, they so, would have collected more oil you well. After all, share control more than 55% of the resources in, in Biafra land. So Germany would have gotten oil you well just to kill us. But they don't know some nation, some country has grown beyond oil you well. Britain can die in oil you well in Biafra land. But Germany certainly are not that kind of people. It is simple. It is a right to civil disobedience. They, they, are, they are trying to lobby Jama. The, the Jama will now arrest everybody, and Jama will now say, Yes, uh, we stop IPOB, don't move in Jama. But that is the beginning of another thing they are not prepared for. Go ahead, my brother. So they think so they think that uh, the Germany is an is is African country or the Zulu nation. They don't know that Germany is, is one of the countries that preserve and know what human rights is all about this human is even complaining keep on asking is there so is there me does it mean there's no there wouldn't be any arrest the man also replying him he also has seen him so no investigation again the policeman was also also replied ah, my goodness me now I'm um
absolutely none of them. I don't know what adjective we will use to qualify them. My God. My goodness me. Then that's also bring the topic about Asadi Dokopo. Where is the stand of this man? Where is the stand of those? I have respect for this man two years ago. But ever since this man have started talking rubbish about our leader, can you imagine the kind of video he made online for this incident that is trending since two days ago? There was, Where there is was, the stand of Asadi there, Dokopo? There is one of our brother. He almost disturbed me for one year or more than. We say, talk to Asari, talk to Asari. I told him, Asari cannot be trusted. Nobody is a Muslim <laughs> that don't have a, a gender. Nobody, your relative that claim to be Muslim, run for them. They are under oath already. Turning back against the oath will destroy them and maybe their family. That is why we value oath in IPOB. Let our generation, generation wipe out when we wake up to betray IPOB. Let's be more fierce and deadly like they are. Asari is just exposing himself. He just said no. Let him come to this stage. I'm just even marveled from shameless people. What is coming out from this man? Very shameless, hopeless set of man. You can that man cannot be trusted. You know, well, just like you said, when you also were well, analyzing the news, you understand. This is just an open letter that we don't deliver. We have not even read the letter. Because very soon, IPOP all over the world is going to open the letter. And when that... The point is, when all these people are doing what they are doing... They have seen it. They, they, and the other two politicians, after this incident that happened to Igwe, for the matter, my goodness me, it's going to happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, Thank you very much. It is simple. When people like in Nango do come to issue press statement, oh, IPOV, we don't know, we do this. Nango do have only one son. We know where he hide that son. And then Nango do is bringing full enhancement to kill other people's children. Does he think that is only one son will survive? Nango do, you are the only son your father have. Advise your father. Your father, father, your grandfather is a traitor. He groomed your father to be a traitor. We know the night your father took you to hide. We know where you are hiding. If your father continue to support, to aid the killing of other people's children, you will die before your father will die. Advise your father. We are peaceful lovers. Of course, you are one of us. You love peace. Ask your father if your lineage of Nayangodu is Arosa lineage. Then go back to where you come from. We will not allow you to continue after where your father stopped. Your father must repent. Asari must repent. All the sabotoir must repent. If they don't, for the avoidance of doubt. Are you there, caller on the line? Are you there, caller on the line? Switch off your radio and go ahead. Are you there, caller on the line? Caller on the line, are you there? But of course, we must continue. When you call, make sure you are focused. Caller on WhatsApp, are you there? Mazi, good evening. My name is Collins, calling from Hamburg, Germany. Go ahead, the formidable people. That name you call ring a bell. One city in Biafra Ma, land will be happening. Yes, remind us when Biafra is returned, we will just give one community name or one road, Hamburger, so that we remember the, the main. Ma, 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 you are too much. Ma, they get locked, say this thing, you no, know, be Hamburg where it happened. They get locked, say, hey, you no, know, be even the only thing I will say any time of this thing, wait, wait, what happened? Maybe they announce some generally because Hamburg included most of that, most, most cities announced. around. It has been announced no. already. Look for where they are doing in Rigi, anywhere outside Biafra land. Why? Look for where they, are, they can do Rigi in Biafra land, though. It's welcome. They will, we will, we will, the next, the next thing now, the next thing. 
the work I'm doing in this jamming, everybody knows. Any or anywhere their children is going to school, me, I can go there, I can, I can ring bell. Me, ask everybody in Hamburg, they know me, I can ring bell. This one that happened is a small thing. Most of their children will pick them where they are. Most of their children will pick them where they are. All of them must, 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 even that day, somebody was saying, police to arrest him, arrest him. He did that. We are, we, he, he thought that we are in, in Nigeria. Arrest him, arrest him. Police said, come on, get out. Come on, everybody should go back. Everybody should go back. You think you are, you, you know, do you know what is German? German passport is, like, oh, is the second passport in the whole world after Singapore. When you talk of German, man, see, these people, they must, they must, they must rip what they sold. I appreciate my leader. Mas, I appreciate my leader. It's not easy. And there is one man, again, I want to say this to in public here. There is one man in our midst. They call it Okute. In our midst. He's, he's, he's an IPOB member. But every time this man is a saboteur, he's the one that's saying the, 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 the Biafran people that when they, you are spoiling, say, he may be here, he may be here. The next meeting, Mas, you, you will hear it. it is the true. name is Okute. I swear. God bless you, man. Continue. God bless you. Thank you very much. There is a community, family in Abo. They call them Njagwale. Njagwale family. Njo Agu Ale. Evil will not end in the land. Because these evil people know how to drop their seed behind. But in our time, Njo Kagwale. Njoshi. Took a Nigerian lobby. Oh, German, he have to. Does German have yam? You are defiling German land. Go and do your potato now, German. Hopeless people. Every day they are raping people, killing our people. These people can't lend their voice. When Yoruba talk about injustice against Nigerians anywhere, no, it has affected them. Everything they have set us up globally, and they think they will go away with it. Uh, German police, do you mean those IPOB you not be prescribed them? Uh, Ada, please lower your radio. Hello, Go yes. ahead, please. Good evening. My name is Uchama Chukuka from Enugu State. I'm calling from Ada. I thank you. I thank you, my brothers from Germany. We bless our television for Zoo, zoo Country, people of Zoo Country. My Kike Kremada and their entourage. I like it as more that television. They will not go anywhere. They must come back in Biafra land. Anything will happen, they must follow us there for Biafra land. And they did their work. They must see their work. Nothing like you go outside and go eat yam. Go. Those people will go, uh, will go Germany, go eat yam. Then go from there, will go that place and go eat yam. We can go Germany. No, they are, they are advanced. Advanced people. Sorry, we lost that caller. Caller on WhatsApp, are you there? Caller on WhatsApp, are you there? Of course. Are you there? Caller on WhatsApp. Caller on WhatsApp, are you there? Or I should cut you off? Yeah, imagine you there. Go ahead. Good evening. Please. Good evening. I'm here, Mazen. Mazen, good evening. This is Mr. Ifenna Onigwe from New York, USA. I'm calling from Brooklyn, to be precisely. I called you early this morning concerning our brothers in Congo Brazzaville. Yes, that issue and the economic been, capital that is issue point. Has been looked into, my brother. And by now, as I'm talking to you, this. As I'm talking to you this morning, don't worry. You as I'm talking to you this morning, they went, issue. they went to. Don't worry about that issue. It's on the they went to the you. police station I this brother, morning, you, and all of them was locked up. Talk, if you continue to talk about that they issue, of, if you continue to talk about that issue, I will think there is something more you are not telling us. I have told you, you reported that matter. No, hold on, hold on, them. hold on. I don't like people who try to prove a point. Okay. You made a report. And I've contacted the regional rep in charge okay. of that jurisdiction. And I have all the information I need. As I'm talking to you, I know that okay. at about 5 p.m. today in Biafran time, they were still being held by the police. 
and I know the information coming from the okay, police station okay, there. Okay, I'm right, telling we'll you, we you are on bottom of that matter. You made the report. You think we are here to joke? I can't tell you what we are going to do at the end okay, of the day. Let okay. them do what they have to do. So if I say, leave that matter, let everything follow yeah. the natural course. You did well for bringing up that matter. Now we are on, okay. on top my, and bottom my, of that matter. My, 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 Go ahead, my, Lord, my Lord, I surrender my of Lord. Of course, of course. I and we are following that Lord. matter. Our people are our people. As far as every one okay. of us are doing the right thing, nobody will undo us. Not now and never again. Believe me, the matter as I'm speaking to you is on the table of the deputy head of the directorate. And I know they know what to do. But we will watch all of them. Thank you very much for bringing up that information. But I believe you have other things to tell Biafra okay. aside Thank that issue. Uh, what I have to tell Bia France, I, I am just uh, congratulating Bia France because uh, um, everything is taking place. And I congratulate our leader, Mazen Nandekano, the man they couldn't defeat, whatever. Or the, or the man that challenged the whole world and ruined the world because I believe that he's winning the whole world because he's doing the right thing. That's why he's winning the whole world. So, I congratulate all the beer fans, all the IPOB members, because they are doing the right thing. Whoever that said that we are doing the wrong thing, they should form their own and do their own. Let us see. So that is it. I congratulate you, Mazo. Thank you very much. You are brother. filling the gap for us once again. Thank you very Thank much. You, and I, I must and tell you, you all the all information, Biafra. yes, all here, Biafra, the information you brought this morning. It has led us to another level, honestly. The reason I don't want you to get there is, let's know where they are coming from. And so we can be able to know where they are going to. This is how Kotonou Bene Republic arrested our people unjustly. We wait for them. Let's know where they belong to. Because Dangote controls Africa with the resources stolen from Biafra land. Let's know how many countries in Africa that is being fed from the resources stolen in Biafra land. We will know them by their fruit, my brother. Don't go take terrorizing IPOB member okay. everywhere in Africa. And we are following him up. We must know who these people are. Thank you very much for that information once again. Like I said, IPOB leadership is on top of it. They are not going anywhere. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Yes, my brother. Are you there, Kola, on the line? Are you there, Kola, on the line? Once I pick your call, move away from your radio. Go ahead, please. I still want to greet all ICOD members. And I have a, a little word to speak about what really happened. I understand that what happened is a lesson to him. Let him understand that nobody goes to outside country for fish fever. Nyam they eat is a traditional something. He's supposed to do it in Nigeria, even in his own place. So if they invite him to come, he could have asked those people to come down and come and celebrate him. Is it now that deceive him? Nyam deceive him. Nyam would do, deceive him. Nyam would do Nyam run, run away and ask him to go. So I still want to talk about that matter. Another one, they said that IPOB are terrorists. But I, I don't see any terrorists without a gun. I have no heard that IPOB have killed anybody or Nandekalo uh, have killed anybody. I have not heard about that. But all I know that those they call terrorists is those who used to kill. They carry guns to kill people. I just understand that these people like to paint through. They don't want to speak the truth, but they know the truth. Is it not man the father? Man the father is an elderly man. But they chased him out of his kingdom, he gave kingdom, he left the throne. Where is he now? Is he not an elderly man? But just ordinary protest. They 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 you, they 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 man, they invaded his house, endangered law law, endangered everybody, kill people. That is not an insult. I tell so you, those of you in diaspora, know what they are doing. the people in diaspora is their town. Anywhere, those in EEG people, baggage sheet for them. Baggage sheet for them. When they come to Italy, throw them that sheet. By now, I mean, Equiremadu will still be sent in. 
prepare a bag of shit for them in Spain. Let them come and do it. Did you not hear what Chine Achibe told you people in 1995? That anybody who prepared to go and do Iriji, where they are supposed to do Irindomi or Iri Bof Bof. The gods of the seven seas and the seven mountains will be waiting for them. Now you have seen us. We are that god of the seven seas and the seven mountains. Go Thank ahead, you. please. Thank you very much, Ada. People don't understand. Are you there? Call on the line. Call on the line. Are you there? Go ahead, please. Hello, my name is Good evening. Go ahead, uh, please. Yes, uh, the whole man is turning around. Uh, and what is this? And the commander has seen the other thing. I never knew that he could be a very good uh, sprinter. Uh, but God has shown him that he will never run anywhere. He will just be running around. Look at what is happening in the group and he's then. Uh, in a uh, 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 jammy to eat a uh, yam, God will always punish all of them in their own coin. They have all seen everything, and they're now trying to make sure that they keep themselves comfortable. They can never be comfortable. Doesn't even <clears throat> life we are living today has been made miserable by these same people, and they think they can go away with it. It can never work. God will always vindicate us in this struggle. The struggle has just begun. The, the run he made has shown that this, the, the run has just started. It's not the tip of the iceberg, and the whole world is talking about it. Even one foolish lady that uh, one of these uh, radio stations in, uh, in Abba, uh, what is her name, uh, 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 Magic FM, this lady will always not want to hear ITV. Today she's talking ITV. I thank God for that. But, uh, everything we do, we are doing it in the interest of our people and the dignity of God. In New Zealand, where I come from, everybody now is now keying up. Everybody is keying up. And this one now is making everybody to sit up. And this is anywhere. People should be making information that the thing, this particular issue should continue this way. It is. The, so I have no. From here, I am just there. My son, if you want to be a good Jaffa, join ITC. If you want to be a good Jaffa, join ITC. Oh, join, join ITC. Join, join ITC. Join, join ITC. ITC is key. We will never be like Sudan because Sudan never got it right. And Marie Nandekano, our leader, is making sure that we get it right. And as we get it right, we will never have two factions that will come up at the end of the whole struggle and begin to fight each other. Because that's what people will say. Ah, if you come back now, you'll be like that. We will never be like that. Thank we you. all must join ITOB and make sure we work in one harmony. Thank well, you, my brother. Of course, there is no two ways about it. Thank, Thank you, my sir. brother. Are you the caller on WhatsApp? Yes, of course. Go ahead, ma, 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 my heart is bleeding. I must tell you, it is now obvious, it's now clear that the people in Nigeria is in trouble in, the, in, the, in a very, very big mess in the hands of uh, Nigerian evil men, call themselves politicians. Look at the way they are persuading this policeman from Germany, asking him, continue asking, continue asking. They are lobbying. Hey, Jama, oh Jama, God. please, we oh give, we give you one or you oh Hey, please help us oh subscribe by POD. Hey, Jama, please, please, Maze, Jama. They think Jama Maze, people are stupid. Maze, Maze, Maze. The only way out on the we are in the midst of pythons. Those call your Politicians don't never, 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 never mean well for you. They all want to die. And now understand what is happening in Nigeria. No rule of law. Everything is gone and bled. Oh my God. Nigeria is in trouble. How can we find our, how can we go away from this trouble? The only solution, my brethren, is only IPOB, indigenous people of Biafra. 
are you go and revolt yourself, go and take care of your nation. Yorubas, wake up. Everybody should wake up. You don't have government, you don't have senator, you don't have a, 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 a house of uh, anything called face of government in your presence. Nothing, nothing. And the no way out, Nigeria can never know peace. As long as 1967 genocide is involved, no way, no way, no way, no way. That is what I want to make. My heart is bleeding. I, I now understand that Nigeria is full of evil. Both church, both uh, politi politics, everything in Nigeria is corrupt. Everything in Nigeria is not even only corrupt. Even Sepa have even run away from Nigeria. Of course. Oh my God. Long ago. Oh my. Long oh my ago. God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Oh, oh, German, German, uh, please, are, are you not arresting the IPOB? German, please, oh, oh my. arrest them, we hey. give you all you wear. You know that Nigerian, man is our senator, Yoshi. This is the time for you to know, if you can be able to analyze this question. Now, that this lady that is asking German police, you will understand that you are in big mess. There's, you can never find justice in Nigeria. Never, 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 never. Nigerians wake up. If you call yourself Nigeria, wake up. Thank they you very much. Wake up. Anybody, everybody should wake up. Whoa. Thank you very much. It's better. We, it's better we die once and for all than than to live this kind of life. Whoa. Thank you very oh much. Oh my God, unbelievable. We must Thank continue. you very much. Yes. Uh, Maze, uh, uh, I still remember uh, Maze Shuku Kandia John Mado. God passed into a John Mado. So I'm calling from Sweden. May God continue to empower you, continue to help you to sanitize us. You are yes, sanitizing sir. us. Ada, go ahead, please. All right. I'm happy to get you tonight. Go ahead, please. You are doing a good work. To go to Kajama, we bless you so much. I am calling from Ada. And I'm one of the IPOB members. I'm so delighted about what really happened yesterday. We serve the zoo, we serve them right. So happy about what they did to all these zoo leaders. Because to the rest of the world, they will always not behave as if they are serving us, but they are just serving their own stomachs. And more await many of them, even Oju or Kalo, many of them. And that is just at Lagos, Babylon. The Lord will judge them, and the Lord will bring all of them to judgment. Because we and our brothers, you know, in the diaspora, we know all that will be passing through. The more await them, more away them. I'm so happy when the German police was announcing that there was no arrest led so far. And there will be no arrest, no, no arrest, no arrest will be led. Yes, arrest in killing us here. So we are brothers and wait for them over there. The Lord will bless you, all you principal officers that the Lord has been using to restore Jaffa. And my eyes and the eyes of all you that have been laboring, you see Jaffa. You see, you see, you see. The Thank Lord will be much. your strength. Thank you very much. The Lord much. will be your strength. And you too. All her Biafra. All her Biafra. The truth cannot be overemphasized. We are the most endangered species of Homo sapiens. Everything about us is being threatened. We have been playing a game of perceiving. But for how long? I think it's time. We will rise. It is time we confront these monsters once and for all time. And thank God we have IPUB and her leadership. Are you, can you hear me call on WhatsApp? Yes, uh, Lord Onyebe, I can hear you. Um, this is Mazim Badike from New York. Good evening, sir. Greetings. Greetings. Yes, greetings to my fellow beer friends, our leader, our deputy, and all the people working 
as seriously to make sure we get our, our nation Biafra. Mazi, I won't spend much of her time just of this issue we are discussing today because this problem is very easy to solve from diaspora. We need to hold all the communities president association in, United, in the whole Western world, even in Asia, that are bringing these politicians in because when you get their leaders that are bringing these people in, we'll be able to tell the community where they came from that this president of this association are one of the people sponsoring terrorism in Biafra land. And as soon as the message gets to their family, I think nobody, no, none of these people will come in, in the diaspora because we need to isolate them to one place. We have one inviting them in, in Atlanta, which we are making calls already to tell the, the people in Ngwa that this man is the one giving info. If your family member die in Ngwa land, this man that is holding, hosting Okezi Bazo in Atlanta must be held responsible because they are the terrorists in the diaspora. These are the losers in the diaspora that don't even care about our families back home, and we need to hold them responsible. Any, any communities in Biafran land that is holding convention in diaspora and they hook up, invite all these killer politicians to their convention, Mazi, we need to hold those present of those associations responsible because if they don't ab abet them in the, in the diaspora, they won't be coming. And our land will be, will be sanitized. But these people bringing them here, they drop the $5,000 for them. Because when you look at most of people inviting these people in diaspora, look at their background. They don't have a place home. They have already bought their, you know, their graveyards in diaspora when they die, bury them there. So imagine, Keep up a good work. We are here. We're waiting for them in the United States here. Because what these people don't understand, that whatever happens to them in diaspora, we have a record of the speech they make against IPOB. How they tell the army, if you see them, shoot them aside. Because in the Western world, they work with the evidence that you, if you give an order to kill somebody with a flag without having a weapon, if the person kill their family member and they revenge against you in diaspora. You don't have no case. But this is what these people don't understand. They're trying to use jungle justice they've displayed in Nigeria to go to the Western world. I think it's like that over there. Like people like Soludo, he make a speech. He's one of the people that don't, Obi not endorsed Buhari before he died to be an APC that bring Boko Haram to our land. Now all of them is underground because we need to put the man in the spotlight. He's one of the people that bring Boko Haram in Biafran land. So Ludo is there. We, let's not forget about him. No, no matter they, where they, they might be they, asking. They will reveal themselves. It's stage by stage. We, we, we know them because we have their when our already. leader was talking, we have all of them and we know where they make the species. We're waiting for them to come in the diaspora. That's the evidence we're going to present to the court against them. None of them have no hiding place to be, Mazi. Keep up a good work. We're here. We're waiting for them. And we encourage our people in the United States. Don't be afraid. If you're a citizen of the United States, nothing will happen to you. Everything we have to display in the court. We are the system works, not in the zoo. Mazi, all hell be Afra. All hell be Afra. The truth cannot be overemphasized. EDG is allowed in Biafra land where they plant EG. EDG is not even allowed in Yoruba land not to talk of our Salah. Hey, they are going to write to EDG. He that go to another man's land to do EDG should get ready for the gods, the seven gods of the sea and of the mountains. All said, Yana. Chini Achibe told you this in 1995 in Yoshi. Are you there? Call on the line. Call on the line. Are you there? And of course, it's your epileptic network. Call on the line, are you there? Good, good evening, and I will advise you to try and speak louder, my brother. Go ahead, please. Caller on WhatsApp, are you there? Yes, Mazi Onibe. Go ahead, please. Um, uh, good morning from Moscow. Um, this is uh, Mazi Ndikom. Uh, I came from Omwaka in 
or no problems in Biafra lands. But I serve the indigenous people of Biafra here in Russia as the coordinator. So it's a pleasure to be uh, a partaker in the evening uh, supper in our radio. Uh, actually, since the, this evening, I have been following all the people that comment, make comments, and the, both our women and our great uh, men that are in diaspora, and both and those uh, that are in Biafra land, men lions that are uh, defending the safe without uh, any gun or, bu uh, or bullet against the Fulani terrorists. I greet all of them. I respect all of them, and also I pray that you could come bless all of us. Uh, also, I want to greet my uh, savior and the hero, uh, our great uh, uh, spirit leader, Martin and the Kano, who, the man that made it happen, the man that saw tomorrow. Because without him, all this we are talking today, we will, we will not be here to talk about them. He is the person, he is the man that uh, uh, took up the challenge. When others, mm -hmm. we are uh licking the legs and the shoes of fulani parasites somebody like a uh, soludo as uh, our, 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 the last speaker from us just mentioned is uh, 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 if you go back to his uh, uh, uh eloquent uh, uh, speeches that he made concerning ipb concerning the struggle you see, we, he, we thought that he would have been one of the pillars that we make this uh, 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 possible. But I don't know, with all the intellectual, with all the learning, with, with all the degree they have, then they're still under the shoe of Aosa Fulan. The tea baffles me. One of my brothers said that uh, Ishina wear popcorn. Ishina wear popcorn. Okay, that is, when I see what these people are supposed to be, Learn it. Yeah. What they are doing? How they following, following our enemy, serving our enemy, following them, supporting them to kill their own people. That's what Bakus does. it mean that they don't have conscience? They don't have eye? They don't have mind? What type of heart they have? That is only because it is good for them, for the and their family, and then others can go to hell. So that's why I so much appreciate this. Uh, a new uh, uh, face of the struggle that we are in now, as that is the uh, as we have started um, treating them now, giving them the treatment that is about to is about to support to receive abroad. Uh, this is just the beginning. Those that are crying, uh, my advice to them: those that are yearning, those that are yapping, those Yoruba, Kota Media, and their supporters that are trying to show that they, they are surprises. My message to them is that uh, it's too early for them to cry because uh, the real time for them to cry is coming. So all this type of uh, noise making, they're making, they're saying all the comments, both as and go people that cannot be constant in their uh, decision and in their way. I'm telling them that uh, it's too early for them to cry. As they have made our people, as they have made us to leave our land, many of us have been in diaspora for 20 years, some have lived in 30 years, some 40 years. As they have made us to leave our, our as will be of others, our as will be nigh, air question only, where Nututu, Ipota, where Manyungo, Goziala, Kele Olisa, Kele Chuko Tadiyama, they made us to, that is not to be there. And all of us live in a suffering, then they think that uh, it will control like that. So I'm saying that uh, this uh, egg massage that you just started, uh, it will continue. From egg, it will that is the way to reach water. From water, it will that is the way, even tea and they also burger, burger that they are eating in, 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 Germany, in Germany very soon. Those burger will come out from there. From, from, from their mouth and their from, from their anus. Thank you very because, much. Because uh, yes, our people, but people, we are not happy, and also nothing can make us to go back. So this is just the beginning, and I pray that uh, all of us that are started this struggle, we continue and push it on until we reach our promised land, and our promised land is Biafra. the nation of Biafra. Nothing more, nothing less. Yeah.
Thank you very much. We must continue. Federation. Kola on the line, are you there? Good evening. Good evening. Go ahead, good evening. Go ahead, please. I am the one for government. lecture in and the next scene I get swallowed in the line in the Ferro, Mandutia. Oh, and I make a little cook a car drama. Oh, no, 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 Thank you very much. We must continue. The world must understand the reason why we are doing what we are doing, why we are going to do what we will do until Nigeria disintegrates. Are you there? Call on the line. Call on the line. Good evening. Go ahead, please. I am a coordinator of Obokrala Zone, Umode, formerly Shelter Zone. I'm here to, I'm so happy for what our people did in Germany. That to show them that we are everywhere. That to tell them that they don't have any place to hide. They think that they can cause problems, they can kill us, they can set us off, and they, they will go and hide. No. We are telling them this time that they will not hide anywhere. We are everywhere, all over the world. There's no place for them to hide. This is just the beginning. We will chase them out from this country, this, this, this land, and they will not see any place to hide. I'm here to, to I'm so happy for what our people did down there. I'm here to tell our people to be resolute. Hello, sir. Can you hear me? Hello? Okay, sir. I'm here to tell our people to be resolute. Biafra have already come. They cannot stop Biafra. Some people have been praying, uh, we need peace. Let there be peace. Let get this, let get this, this thing with peace. Let me tell you some, some people who don't know. There is no peace in Nigeria. And praying for peace is a prayer that God cannot answer in Nigeria. Because Nigeria is a hard, hard, hard darkness of... Nigeria okay. have murdered peace and as yes. such should not desire for it. Yes. So there is no peace. Anybody calling for peace. I, I, I even telling people, both in my church and my fellow pastors, if you are praying for peace for Nigeria, there will not be peace. The only prayer you can Your pray, family will them, be like Nigeria. Yes. Your children will be like Nigeria. He said, I want everybody to change their prayer point. 
starting from today. If you're a minister, if you're, if you're a child of God, change your prayer point. The only prayer that God can answer fasting is to, is to destroy this contact because this is an evil contact, a corrupt and hard, hard darkness of Satan. Thank so you very much. We, we must destroy this country. We need Biafra. Biafra we must get. You see. Thank you, sir. You see. Thank you very much. We must continue. Are you the caller on WhatsApp? Yeah, I'm here. Must go anyway. Go ahead, please. Oh, hey, Biafra. Oh, hey, Biafra. I'm calling from Tohakata. My name is Mweke Torochuku. All the way from Biafra land. Regarding what happened in uh, Germany, that is nothing but an ice tip of an ice tip of iceberg. In my own opinion, I went to hear my band self because all these politicians are the reason why all of us scattered all over the world. It is not in our own decision to leave our own fatherland. They are the one who force us out. Now they have bring Fulanese to take over 14 locations in Enugu land and nobody is saying anything about it. On top of that, they went ahead to bring up Python Python dance to make sure there is no opposition against their plan. But at the end, Chukwu Kikababa will set us free. And Biafra will come. Oh, hey, Biafra. Oh, hey, Biafra. You see, we must continue. Call on the line. Are you there? Good evening, Ma. Go ahead, please. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Can you hear me call on WhatsApp? I can hear you, my Mazon Ibe. Go ahead, please. My mentor. My mentor. Uh, Nigeria, you can see. You you pursue Namdekane out. And then now you have seen another Namdekane. My name is Christopher Ugo. I'm only from Angola. Angola is in South Africa. Mazo Nibe. More grief to your elbows. More grief to my leader, Mazo Namdekane. More grief to my spiritual monk, the taproot of the Nigeria, which I'm of. More grief to all the leaders of our people. About what happened in Germany, God has given us another grace, and we thank God for that grace. Mazoni, I want to talk to you, and I want to talk to our leader, Namdekano, and which you more for. 
please, can you name all those that are in the list of a uh, black list of RPOB? Tell us that we are in the, the diaspora. We can know them. Call them on Radio Diafra. If they did not come to the Radio Diafra and defend their, themselves, we are waiting for them abroad. The, the reason why that list has not come out yet is number one, they are not yet complete. Number two, some of them will repent before the end of today. We are giving them enough time. You know, that is the hour of grace. In due time, okay. they will be published. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Mazoni I have lived in Northern State for many years. All this that I started the Kobo are doing. I call the Nam Kalo. 2013, before he went to prison, there is something that I explained to him. If you are in the house of people, there is something that house people that used to do. Those that are in evil land, they don't understand the meaning. And those the Yoruba people, they don't understand the meaning. But we are doing it. You can see that, for instance, now if somebody goes to our land, they will change cloth for him. They will change cloth for him. Or they will change the staff. Or they give him seat to seat. I said to them, they come, if you went to Nigerian prison, don't eat their food, don't change their cloth, don't change their staff, don't allow anything, don't allow anything from them to enter into you. We don't understand what it means. All those people that you see, all Jews are kind of, I started the Cobra, and they so on that they went to Muslim. I want you to watch something that you, you will be surprised. If you see an, a, a, a planning man, look upon his head, forehead, you will not see the mark of a, a, a mark of Salah on his forehead or her forehead. But if you see a repentant, a repentant person that is repented from Christian to Muslim to the Muslim, in the Muslim land, that, that, that mark on their forehead is not natural because they are hitting their head on the ground. There are some certain sacrifices that you do for that person. If you die, Repent and to leave Muslim, you become mad. I have witnessed it many times, not one, not two. Now, Asari Dakobo knows what is inside. Asari Dakobo, you know, we, there are many people that like you in the Northern State, we have seen, we saw what you see, what you are, you are, you are inside. There is nothing attracting anybody in the, to enter into a Muslim. Changing stuff for a Muslim is, is not a, just a joke. If they change your cloth, if they change, give you their cloth and give you the, you give them their own, it means they have taken away your sins and they give you the way so you behave like them and dance on their own tone. If they change the staff, I just want to talk out all those of evil people or young people that have changed cloth or change the staff or, or change anything from seat. They you go to them, they dress it and give you. Just watch them how they are behaving. It is the outside tradition, they call it refuido. Which means refeido, you will test according to your tune. They, they, that is refeido, it will not leave you till you die. That is what they are doing. In lying, in the outside religion, Muslim religion, lying against the Christian is not a sin. Cheating the Christians is not a sin. Stealing from the infidel is not a sin. Killing the infidel is not a sin. If you read Quran chapter 47, verse 3 and, the, verse 3 and the 4. Please, that's the Please, that's the You are a Muslim. They explain to us to Ryan chapter 47, verse 3 and 4 for us. They explain it to us. You know the truth. You know the truth. That's the Kobo. You cannot live Muslim. Any day you dare to live Muslim, you will die or you become mad. So, anybody that went out went of land and changed the seat or changed change the staff or they, they, they give him, they change cloth for him. I want you to mercy for that person. That person is in a horrible bondage. So, my dear leader, thank you very I want much. you to pray for them. God bless you. Thank you. And hopefully, this is where we draw the curtain for this evening's segment. I appreciate those of you who are able to call in. To say apology to those who cannot call in because we have to shut for now, close the curtain for now. But understand, we are not here to conquer anybody. We are not here to destroy anybody. We want the sovereign state of Biafra to be restored. That as it was in the beginning, that it might also be that way in the end. But you say, no, Biafra will not be restored. Biafra is dead and buried. You will do that on the expense laying the foundation with your first son. And certainly you will raise the gate with your last child. 
for in the end, your lineage will be wiped out. How, make no mistake about that. We remain the children of the Most High. May God be with all of us and sincerely genuine dear friends. With undying love, we have loved you. And even so, had Chuku Kikabiyama love us more than others. Yes, Tamono Abase. They love us more than we can imagine. Good night from here, and in day we know.